Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. You are watching Math with Yasser Arfa. Today we have a third lecture when integration of the trigonometric function when they have the odd power. We are going to discuss a very important technique and we have a third lecture here when a function having the odd power we have to adopt a very important strategy there to find out the integration there. Now here this is sine square x and this is cos cube x. So here we have the odd power here. So we have discussed a very important technique which is related to the odd power here. So what we have discussed here, if we have the odd power there, if we have the odd power there, we have to separate a linear function from the function having odd power there. So this is cos cube x. We can write down cos square into cos x. We have to separate cos x here. And then we have to change the cos square x to its relative formula there. So this is sin square x. Cos square x is it is equals to 1 minus sin square x. Again listen dear students, this is cos cube x. We are going to discuss a very important technique there, a power with having the odd power there. So what was the technique? We have to separate a linear function from that odd power. That is the cos cube x, we have to separate cos x. So this cos square, we have to change it into its relative formula. That is 1 minus sin square x. Now we have to multiply this sin square with this bracket. So this is sin square x, sin square multiplied by sin square, it is sin power 4x into cos x. Now we have to multiply cos x dx with these two functions and with the sign of integration there. So this is sin square x into cos x dx minus sin power 4 cos x dx. When we have to use this strategy there, then this function, this is the function and it is its derivative. So we have to suppose this one, t is equals to sin x, we have to differentiate this, with respect to x, and the function given to you with its derivative, then we have to suppose that t, so this is dt over dx, the derivative of sin x, it is cos x. So this is here dt is equals to cos x of dx. Now we have to put these results here. So this is sin, we have to suppose that it is t, so it is t square x cos x dx, it is equals to dt. minus this is sin x it is equal to t power 4 so this is t power 4 and dt cos x dx <coughs> it is equal to dt now we have to integrate with respect to t here so this is 2 we have to add plus 1 divided by the result t power 4 plus 1 divided by 5 and plus c C, we have to put there C. So this is t power 3 over 3 minus t power 5 over 5 plus C. Now we have to put the value of t, that is the sin x. So this is sin cube x over t 3 and this is sin 5x over 5 plus C. So this is the answer of this question.
we have to use a technique of all trigonometric functions there if they have the odd power there we have to use this strategy there to find out the integration Thank you so much dear students. If you like this video, please share to your friends. Subscribe my channel. Math is Yasir Rafat. Allah Hafiz.